Hello everyone and welcome to another Terraria Let's Play. This is Nick with CoopCritics.com and this is a very special episode because today we are going to go fight the Wall of Flesh. Yes, I'm tired of putting it off. Uh, I've got I've got all the gear that I need. I've got full molten uh, molten armor set. I've got a lot of good gear down here. I've got all the weapons I could uh, ever hope to find in pre-hard mode. Um, so I. I am done making excuses. I've got a chest full of voodoo dolls, so I have plenty of tries here. Uh, and I'm joined today by my good friend, Edifex. Um, jump around for us, Edifex. There he is. Uh, you won't be able to hear him talking, but he'll be joining us today. He will be my silent sidekick. Um, but we're going to go ahead and head out. We're not going to dilly-dally around. We've got everything we need. I've got a lot of inventory space cleared for uh, hopefully getting some good loot. I will be, I guess, alternating between my mini shark, my star cannon, my phoenix blaster, maybe a little bit of the water bolt. And we kill the zombies on the way. Um, so hopefully we can get this in the first try. I, I don't, I'm not going to hold my breath, but maybe we can do that. We've already spent uh, a good amount of time in previous episodes and then uh, off camera here putting platforms down all the way well not all the way but most of the way across hell and so we'll, we'll have a easy platform to kind of run along while we're shooting back at the wall of flesh and that way we don't have to watch out for lava and jumping up and down and all that stuff it won't be take a little bit of the difficulty out of it Let's get through here now I know once we actually defeat him, we will officially be in hard mode, and that kind of scares me, but is also exciting at the same time. I've seen all the cool stuff you can do in hard mode, but also the fact that like the corruption spreads, and then you have the new biome uh, called the Hollow, and I don't really know. I don't know what to think about that. It kind of worries me. So here's our platform. Um, I think. Let me look at my map. Watch my back. Yeah, I think we're going to go all the way. Yeah, we're going to go all the way to the left, and we'll start over there in hopes that... Don't, don't get killed already. We'll start way over on the left, and that should make him move, make the wall of flesh move to the right, like from left to right on the screen. And that, will, that way we'll ensure we have the most possible um, platform space, and we're not going to run out of that on our way. This will be, I actually have spawned in the Wall of Flesh once before, if you saw a previous episode. It was an accident. Um, it was my first trip to hell, and I killed a voodoo demon over lava, and then the voodoo doll fell in lava, the Wall of Flesh spawned, and I cried. Not really, but inside I cried a little. But that is my only experience in uh, fighting the Wall of Flesh. So we'll see how this goes. See, we have a long, long platform here. Goes on forever. So if this, if we run out of platform before we kill him, that's going to be surprising. That's going to be, that's going to mean that he is either that we've either either lasted a long, a lot longer than I thought we would, or um, he's just a lot tougher than I thought. Okay, let's go ahead and get rid of these demons if we can. We don't need him to have any help. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and get the voodoo doll and I'm going to throw it in. Um, can I just throw it in this lava and then drop down? Okay, demon. You're really getting on my nerves. I'm going to try to just drop it in this lava right here and then drop down. Alright, here it goes. I'm going to switch to my mini shark to start off with. Oh, here it comes. Alright. Aim for the eyes. Aim for the eyes, Josh. Keep a decent distance from him. I think he speeds up in a little while. Oh, I meant to take iron skin potions. I didn't grab any. Oh, no. That could be bad. Could regret that. Don't let his tongue grab you. Don't get too close. Those little hungry things are coming out, too. Shoot him in the eye. 
We need to get you some ranged weapons. I'm going to switch to this. Maybe this will help. Oh no. These hungry guys give you hearts, I think, if you kill them. You can shoot them in the mouth, too, but I think the eyes take the most damage. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. He's doing way more damage now. Oh, no. Head effects died. Oh, crap. No, 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 no! Oh my gosh. Oh, well crap. That did not go well. I need to get the iron skin potions. Okay, I'm gonna get my potions. All right, so the first attempt didn't go so well. I'm gonna grab a few of these. I'm gonna give you one, Josh. Let's grab another voodoo doll. Make sure, don't take that potion now. Take it once you get down there. Um, let's see if there's any other potions that would help us. We could do an iron skin. Shine regeneration provides life gener regeneration. That wouldn't be bad. I'm going to give you one of these too. Oh, I just took it instead. Dadgummit. Okay, we got to hurry. <laughs> Archery, swiftness, iron skin. I already gave you iron skin. Hunter. As the location of enemies increases. Mana regeneration, obsidian skin, lesser restoration. Uh, invisibility, magic power. Um, I'm going to take a couple of these down. Hey, Josh. What are your effects? Come up top and grab that. All right. So take that. Um, I just gave it. You you have it. So once we get down there, take the take both of those potions I gave you. The iron skin and the um, what was the other one I gave you? The other one is going to do 20% more magic damage. So if you use the water bolt with it, yeah, if you use the water bolt with it, uh, that'll help. All right, you ready? Round two. All right, I couldn't tell how much damage we were doing to him. I kept seeing health bars, but I think that was the hungry. I forgot to use my my star cannon or star blaster or whatever was it called? Star cannon. Yeah, there we go. The iron skin potion should help a lot though. It will buff our buff our defenses pretty good. Okay. Back to hell we go, round two. Get back when you get back down here just run all the way to the left 
and we'll start in the same place. We, I don't think we were really in danger of ever running out of platform because um, he wasn't moving too fast, but he, was just, he just started doing so much damage. Especially once you died, he was like only focused on me. That made it a lot harder. <laughs> There's one of our gravestones. That's probably mine. Yours is coming up right up here. Somewhere. Maybe. Or not. Maybe I've already passed it and I just didn't realize it. Oh, no. Here we go. Here's some hearts. Now I find hearts and mana stars when I don't need them. I shouldn't be picking them up. Probably should be jumping over them. Oh, get away. Dang it. Can't help but pick it up. Alright, okay. Here's the end. Alright, let's do that. Alright, uh, watch my back. Kill those guys. I'm going to take my iron skin and I'm going to take my magic power. Did you take both of yours yet? <laughs> Alright. I'm about to throw him in. What? What happened? Oh no! He hadn't arrived yet. I threw it in and it didn't kill him. Are you kidding me? No, I didn't grab anymore. <laughs> okay. Uh, you don't die. I'll be right back. That's frustrating. Why did it take him so long to arrive? What a waste. Okay. Got another one. I'm headed back down. I may fast forward this part for the for the viewers. That's frustrating. I should have paid attention. I thought he was there. I uh, know, right? As soon as I sacrifice him, he shows up. Coming, coming, coming. Does your uh, does your pet dinosaur do damage? Yeah, you'd think the dinosaur of all the pets would do damage. At least more damage than a a bee. Uh, I don't, I don't, I don't know that they'll ever make him do damage as an update. I know that you can get, like in hard mode, you could get something called the slime staff, and it is a pet slime. But the pet slime, he doesn't just do damage, but he act actively seeks out to do, to like, seeks out to attack your enemies. Yeah, the slime is a little like kind of translucent green. And he'll actually uh, run over and attack guys. Uh, I don't have a slime pet. I have several other pets. I'm almost to you. I kind of want to collect all the pets. I want. I feel like I want all of them. Well, 
My iron skin potion it only has a minute and a half left. My mana potion just ran out. So that's frustrating. Yep. Alright. You ready? I'm going to try this again. Hang on. Let me kill this stupid demon below me. goodness. Well, I get to start off um, like four hearts down thanks to that douchebag. I'm going to wait. I'm going to take another health potion right before. Will you get these bats off of me? Okay. Here goes that. Here goes the voodoo doll. Is that you shooting the water bolt, or did that stuff come from him? Oh boy, I thought that was you last game. I wasn't even dodging it. You can attack the hungry, sometimes they'll drop stuff. Took my other uh, iron skin potion there. I can't shoot this through the floor. Hey, get this demon behind us. Yeah, they are. Oh! I got him! I switched to my star cannon and killed him. I got him! Alright, let me get all this. Don't go in here. This is all my loot, not yours. You stay away. Get your own loot. Clockwork assault rifle. Kill this demon on me. I got the Wall of Flesh trophy, the Quick Pone Hammer, and where's that assault rifle? Hurtful Clockwork Assault Rifle. I need to try this sucker out. Collect all my Demonite brick. Hey Kyle, it's a new guide. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna sit. I'm not gonna sit down here and uh, and figure out all this stuff. All right, we defeated the wall of flesh. Woohoo! I need to find a place to put my trophy. Uh, I bet I could go right in the middle here. There's probably room for it. I'll put it right there. Yeah. Oh, it's not even. It's gonna bug me. Let's put it somewhere else. We'll put it. Put it right here. We are officially in hard mode now, and that is kind of scary. Um, I got an assault rifle. Let's check this sucker out. Oh, burst fire. Ooh. And I got ten gold coins out of that. And I got a quick pone hammer. I'll have to reforge these things to, to get better stuff from them, or to get the better modifiers, I guess. But yay! All right, we, now we can actually celebrate. I should have bought uh, a lot of stuff from the party, the party girl. I should have bought some uh, some streamers and uh, party poppers. Where is she? Where are you, Star? 
Come here, star. I'm gonna buy... Here we go. And I'm gonna give you some. Where are you, Josh? Where are you, Edifex? Alright, I'm coming up there. I'm right here. Uh, I gave you too many. There, take those. And now we're going to celebrate beating the wall of flesh and we're officially in hard mode. Come over here so I can actually see you. Come over here so I can see your pretty, your pretty face. Woohoo! Welcome to hard mode. Alright, fun's over. Real crap begins. That's going to do it for this episode, guys. Um, in the next episode, we will be... <laughs> Uh, officially exploring for the first time in hard mode. Uh, there's a lot for us to figure out, obviously. Um, so, if you like this video, please go ahead and click that like button. Uh, it really helps us out. Um, and subscribe for more videos like this in the future. Thanks, I'll see you next time. So every time I destroy one of these demon altars, it's uh, blessing my world with new stuff. <laughs>